Hi everyone, today I'm going to be decorating a cake in the style of the Bayeux Tapestry in honor of Battle of Hastings Day, which I'll explain in a minute. First, I'm going to cover the cake with a layer of frosting to make a blank canvas, so to speak. And then, since I'm a cake decorator and not an artist, I'm going to sketch out, to the best of my ability, the picture that I'm trying to draw, and then I'm going to fill it in with all the colors. I'm trying to imitate the tapestry as closely as possible, so I'm going to try to make it look like it's woven. I apologize for the lighting and sound quality this time. I was focusing mostly on the cake, as you can tell. The Battle of Hastings took place in 1066 between William, Duke of Normandy, and Harold Godwinson. The background to the battle was the death of a childless king in January 1066, which set up a succession struggle between several claims to his throne. Harold, the one I just mentioned, was crowned king shortly after Edward's death. Harold was at once challenged by two powerful neighboring rulers. Duke William claimed that he had been promised the throne by King Edward and that Harold had sworn to agree to this. The other king of Norway also contested this succession. His claim to the throne was based on an agreement between his predecessor and the earlier king of England. William then invaded, and then the Battle of Hastings took place. Unfortunately, Harold Godwinson was shot in the eye with an arrow and died. The Bayeux Tapestry is a tapestry depicting the Norman Conquest, including the Battle of Hastings. There are so many different sections of the tapestry, and I have done several, but this year I decided to do something with a horse and some people. My dad's an English teacher, and he teaches a course on English history. To celebrate the Battle of Hastings every year to make it fun for the students, he has me make a cake, decorate it in the style of the Battle of Hastings, and then the students get to eat it during class. The Battle of Hastings took place on October 14, 1066. At this point, I'm going to take a little break and just kind of show you how messy I actually am behind the scenes. You just get to see the cake, but I have so many bowls with food coloring, edible gold paint, my mixer, my computer with the tapestry that I'm basing it off of. So at this point, I added in some color details and then I'm going to add some edible gold paint. I've actually never worked with the gold paint before, so it was very interesting. Here's the final product, and then I'm going to put a picture of the Bayou Tapestry in just so you can compare the two. Thanks for watching and I will see you next week.